And hi again, how are you? My name is Dylan Black. You know what? The third annual Burger Festival is running until July 14th at Kelsey's. Amazing place. So let's find out more right now. Joining us, he is the corporate chef for Kelsey's. It's Chef John Humphreys joining us right here on Daytime. How are you? Good morning, sir. Excellent. How are you? Nice to have you here. Busy time of year at Kelsey's? Absolutely. Summer's crazy. Burgers mm -hmm. are flying. I can imagine. That's yeah. good because it's yeah. a burger festival. It is. It's an awesome time at Kelsey's. We yeah. love our burgers. So why do you do this festival every year? It's the third year for this? Well, yeah, it is the third year now. Uh, my first festival was actually my job interview, uh, which went really, really well, wow. obviously. No Where? pressure, yeah. No, no pressure at all. But uh, we love burgers. We're, we're typically all about the, the great big two-handed burly burger, mm -hmm. two hand-pressed patties where we sear it really hard on the flat top. Um, but we're exploring something new now with burgers. Yes, um, you are exploring something about uh, burgers here, uh, plant-based burgers. Plant-based, wow. yeah, very specifically and not veggie burger. That's the bad word. Now okay. everyone's got what they call a, a veggie burger hangover. Everyone's had a bad one where there's corn in it or there's peas. It's a lot heavy in soy and heavy in uh, gluten. Plant-based now is a, it's a really exciting new sort of food technology mm -hmm. where they've really been able to replicate the, the flavor and especially the texture of beef. Like when you bite into this, it's, it's amazing how close it is to beef. Mm -hmm. So your burgers are called the Light Life Burgers? Yeah, Light Life Burger. It's, uh, it's actually a company that's been around a long time, almost exactly exactly as long as Kelsey's has mm -hmm. been around, uh, 40 years, which is incredible. It's just that they're, they're just kind of getting into this new technology that's just coming on the market where they're taking plant protein and really learning how to replicate the texture and mouthfeel and flavor of beef. It's mm -hmm. really quite cool. Okay, so what is different, and I, and I know you're going to make one here in, yeah. in seconds, but what is different between veggie burgers and your Light Life burgers? So the Light Life burger is plant protein. Right, so it's, it's, it's meat, but it's not meat from an animal, it's meat from plants. So it's actually made from pea protein, made here in Canada, and the way they process it, just by extracting the starch and leaving only the protein behind, you get a four ounce patty that's got 20 grams of pure plant protein in it and no cholesterol, which hmm. is awesome. So pea protein as in the vegetable peas. The vegetable Wanted peas, to make yeah. make that clear, okay. Yeah. All right, uh, you do have a couple on the menu. Um, yeah. uh, when it comes to this amazing festival, when it comes to the Light Life Burgers. So which one are you making up here today? So we're gonna do the, the fancy one. This mm -hmm. is the bourbon barbecue burger, mm -hmm. uh, which is actually based on, we've got the beef version of this as well, which is, you know, the two patties of beef, hand pressed, but we also rolled this into the plant patty just because when we thought we want to get into this plant patty business but we don't want it to be about I'm looking for a healthy option mm -hmm. it is healthy but that's not the reason to have it mm -hmm. the burgers at Kelsey's are all about big pow of flavor lots of abundance like you can see we've we're butter grilling our buns mm -hmm. um, we've got like fried onions on here cheese uh, fresh lettuce tomato bourbon barbecue sauce that's just a ton of flavor right yeah. it's, a, it's an awesome eating experience yeah. and really what we're finding is people are they're looking for occasionally I want to have that awesome burger experience I just don't feel like eating an animal right now mm -hmm. Right, and there, there's different reasons for that. There's people that choose that for philosophical reasons. There's people that choose it for sustainability reasons, mm -hmm. where you know plants have a lower impact on the environment than animals do. Uh, and then there's people that choose it for the regular old vegetarian reasons. Yeah. So this just reaches a much wider market. And I mean, I've been a carnivore for a long, long time. I've yeah. been a chef for 30 years. And we're working with this one because of all the patties that I've tried in my life. This one just really resonates as, boy, you can really fool someone that this is beef. Yeah. And oddly enough, we've actually had complaints that I ordered the plant patty and they sent me beef. They've complained. And we're like, no, 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 yeah. wait, we have to bring out the packaging wow. and we show them. No, it's actually light life. It's supposed to be just like beef. That's good. I promise this is the plant patty. That's a good problem to have, I yeah. guess. Yeah. Okay, so do we have to wait for that to grill up before we start putting it together? We have about three minutes left yeah, here. Yeah, so we've got we've cooked one off here. Okay. And so you can see we butter grill our buns, mm -hmm. right? This is just, just for a pure flavor. We're going to put just a little mayo on the bottom there mm -hmm. uh, because fat tastes good. Right. That <laughs> tastes good. Oh, if that tastes awesome, yes. right? Uh, we've got a little fresh lettuce here. We shred it up, right? Actually, let's slice a little bit of tomato here. All right, we'll just take a, just one nice slice of tomato. Yeah. We'll slide that on there. So there's plenty of health benefits here, I can see. Vegetables oh, yeah. added, of yeah, course. Yeah, fresh and healthy, right? Yeah. Uh, we're just going to put just a little bit of fresh red onion on mm -hmm. there, right? And here's a patty we've grilled off just before. We'll stick that on there. Okay. And this is a bourbon barbecue sauce. And you know, I have to give credit where credit is due. This, the beef version of this burger, 
came about from a heart of house kitchen contest where we asked our staff to show us their best ideas for burgers. Mm -hmm. And this is the one from Petawawa, actually, yeah. uh, that won as the beef version. But the flavors were just so fantastic, we thought we've just got to roll this into our veggie uh, plant-based burger as mm -hmm. well, right? Yeah. And the flavors just come across beautifully. Mm -hmm. We've got a little American, a little Swiss on there. We've got some crispy fried onions. Oh, my goodness. Right? Okay. This is, this is something. Right? And then yeah. we've got our butter grilled buns. Yeah. Right? Can, can you tell me about the other burgers? Because it's not just plant-based burgers that you're offering up at this festival. No. Obviously. So the Burger Festival is really a celebration of beef. And this, yeah. this is kind of like the, the newcomer to the beef party. Um, but that's the whole idea of these plant patties is that you can have your grill going. And my grill at home is just a little bit bigger than this one here. Yeah. Just a little bigger. I can imagine. Uh, yeah. Right. Chef and all, but yeah. you can have, here, here's your half with beef burgers, here's your half with plant burgers, and mm -hmm. it's just whatever you're in the mood for right now. Both are going to have an awesome eating experience. Okay. Right? Uh, was I supposed to contribute somehow? You like, should I feel contribute like a nothing, little. Except so for, we've got a uh, couple of uh, house battered fried pickles there, so okay. skewer a couple of those. Dang, okay. And we're just going to throw our butter grilled bun on there. And then I do this. Yeah, and then you do that. Okay. And now, I know you mentioned that I should probably give this a try, but how the heck am I going to try this on live TV and not make a mess <laughs> and all that kind of stuff? But um, you don't mind if I take a bite? No, not at all. Okay. Now, it'll be easier if you don't bite into the skewer, because that'll <laughs> hurt. You think so? Uh-huh. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Yeah, I'll, so I'll save you from the Thanks chin the help. There you go. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Okay. That's all right. I mean, that is something else. Mmm. Okay. <laughs> When does the festival wrap up again? So this is on until the middle of July, mm -hmm. but this is gonna stay on the menu. We've had such awesome results from it. People are asking for it. This has totally replaced our veggie burger. Beautiful. This is here to stay. Kelsey's.ca for more details. Chef John Humphreys, thank you. That is tasty. More daytime coming That's up. Good stuff.